Down to Elijah Wan. While he's still in there, gets Robinson airborne. There's a thousand voices sharing the defense as Elijah Wan. You can turn that into a positive. Of course, he has to. Quit. Elijah Wan now facing the basket. Look at that move. Deflected by Hopper. Elijah Wan with the. Elijah Wan setting up off the dribble. Oh, what a move. Has improved from essentially 32% to 37 and a half. How about that? Not exactly how you draw it up. Trust me. Trust me. Happy birthday. Thank you. Hey, look, <laughs> Jim started out the night saying he didn't like the spotlight. He doesn't want the I attention. I, I am not always trying asking to avoid it. Time <laughs> maker for three. There's your gift right there. Until now. 23 years later. Nobody could knock it on that door. Luke Kennard for three. Off the rim. Follow-up flush for Thon Maker. In no way we score an 18 and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Maker drives it into the lane of the glass, laying it in. Impressive move. Yeah. Thon Maker will catch and shoot the three and drop it in. Detroit turnover, George Hill. Thon Maker. Earlier, this is a run you down block by Son Maker. And no question that it's a good block. He's at half court, almost at half court when Curry caught the I ball. I want to give all the praises and the honor to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah Bahashem, Recha Hakwadash, and double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. Shalom to the top elders of Great Millstone. Also, Shalom to the up and coming elders and the elect and the brothers. Uh, uh, I want to touch on this video here with um, uh, now now the uh, controversy thickens, okay? Because uh, through the spirit, uh, I just saw Apostle Tahar post a video on um, the uh, this guy Seal. Is he an Israelite? Which I clearly believe he is. But now the question, you know, it it, it gets tricky because now if you don't believe he's an Israelite because he got talent, because clearly he has talent. There is, and you have uh, a lot of, you know, you have a few Israelites and a few people saying that heathens can have top talent and uh, even top basketball skills. So now you have to start questioning if the ones you see in the NBA today or e even in the past, such as Michael Jordan, is he an Israelite? And why would you say he's an Israelite? Don't say it's because of the talent. And don't say he just because he's a black man in America. Okay? Because remember, there's tears amongst the so-called Negroes in America too. You know, we got to go on both sides of the spectrum. There's the so-called uh, white man, okay, who is, uh, you have so-called... Uh, well, you have Israelites that look like so-called white men, right? And then you have the uh, Caucasian race, the so-called black man that looks like a black man, but he's not a so-called black man, but he's a so-called white man inwardly, right? See, in order to say that uh, uh, this guy, even Larry Bird, is not an Israelite, okay, or various other people who look white are not Israelites, now you have to say, is the ones you call black, okay, in America, uh, are they Israelites? So uh, I understand that when uh, a famous rapper or something comes up to one of these groups, the first thing they say is that they're Israelite without judging or questioning the spirit. Why do they say they're Israelites? Because they look like a so-called Negro? Okay, but remember, there's tears amongst us as well. So how is it that you know Michael Jordan is an Israelite? How do you know Akeem Olajuwon is not an Israelite, although he's from Nigeria, the west part of Africa? Some Israelites don't even believe that. This guy, Thornmaker, which there is some Israelites who don't believe that he's even an Israelite. How do you know he's even an Israelite or not an Israelite? See, that's where it gets thick, you know? Remember, there's tears amongst Jake. How do you know the uh, average uh, so-called black man that comes up and say, 
hey, I'm an Israelite, according to you guys' doctrine, how do you know that they're an Israelite? How? Can't they be, can't they be a tear? Can you look and say because of their father? Because remember, some of us don't know our great-grandfathers. So how would you know who they are? You can get all the records. You can get all the birth certificates. That don't mean a damn thing. And I'm just doing this raw. I, I'm a maybe quote a scripture. Uh, Deuteronomy 28, 64, when the Lord said he scattered us amongst all nations. So you have to understand that when we got scattered out of Jerusalem uh, and we went into different parts of the world, we all just didn't go into West Africa. Okay. And if some of us did, to flee persecution from the white man, right? Didn't some of us go into East Africa? Didn't some of us flee from that persecution as well? When the when white man came to take us in slavery? You mean to tell me we all just stood the hell around? And we accepted being taken and put on slave ships? Or did we not further spread ourselves amongst other nations to hide from slavery? Although some of the East Africans was known uh, even before we went there for slavery. So the uh, African, so-called African king said, well, you know what? I don't want my people going to slavery. Take the white, um, take the Hebrews. And remember, when a white man came and took us into slavery, it was a different kind of slavery, okay? It wasn't the same slavery or servitude as you know. So did not people uh, flee and go into different parts? Even from at West Africa, we all just sat there I don't think so. So it's not making any sense. Again, if uh, Seal is a Hamite, some people will say, because he got talent. We all know he has talent. And that was the thing with the barge. Everybody said the barge was an Edomite. So what they're saying is these talented singers and these talented rappers and dancers and uh, athletes, they could be heathens. So wouldn't that make it possible that talented athletes that look like the so-called black man, couldn't he be a tear? Yes or no? Could he not be a tear as well? Right? But I guarantee you, a lot of these Israelites that say GMS is going off with these, the white man looking look, looking white as a, a, a Edomite, and a, the African man looking like an African is a Hamite. Right? And they always say there's tears. That's what they say. They believe Tares is just a light-skinned person. But yet we understand, in order for that to work, you would have to think, in order for their ideology to work, they would ha not have to believe that Israelites, uh, I mean, heathen Tares, would look like so-called Negroes too. Remember, it was never really about skin color. Okay? You know, you look at the so-called Arabs, there's Tares amongst them. Israelites amongst them. Okay? So you cannot look at the skin color. So again, would that not, wouldn't that be a possibility that if you're thinking that way, wouldn't Michael Jordan, would he be, could he possibly be a tear? And, and why? And why not? And you're thinking. Because he can, can play basketball? He's the top talented basketball player. Why would you say he's an Israelite? Okay. See, anybody that is top and great that has that black skin color, they were already, uh, uh, you know, set up. They were already acknowledged the fact that they're Israelites. But anybody else that just comes up to the camp and say they have a white father, all of a sudden they're tear. What about Andre Ward? Andre Ward, uh, father, looked like a so-called white man. Would he be a tear? Would he be an Edomite? You know? These are questions, okay? Jeremiah 17 and 4, and even uh, it says, uh, and, I, and thou, even thyself shalt discontinue from thine heritage that I gave thee, and I will cause thee to serve thine enemies in a land which thou knowest not. Okay? So you have to understand that all of us scattered, and when we scattered, we married into, when we lost our heritage, see, these people is, is speaking like we kept our heritage. Did we not marry a white woman, heathen woman, Arab woman, okay, African hermetic woman? Did we not marry into these women? And tell me I'm lying, okay? The, the scriptures don't lie. The Most High don't lie. 
we got scattered amongst all people. Okay? And just for that stumbling block, you know, to protect the elect. Esau not going to know who to grab up because we all scattered. Okay? So when we lost our heritage and our identity, did we not lay with everybody? Did, you know, it's, it wasn't just a black on black relationship. And even though that was, did we not venture off and mess with uh, uh, other women? And did now women mess with heathen men? Hey, just something to think about. You know, you guys got to come off that that uh, that um, blackface only uh, is an Israelite when clearly you got other nations with with black faces and that look like different kinds of people, but can very well still be our people. Now, I'm not here to argue with you that Thorn Mika is an Israelite or isn't an Israelite, you know, but I guess time will tell. But what I can see, there's some brothers who don't believe that, but I can see, I, I believe he has that spirit and that fire of an Israelite. I've seen him in high school, you know, you, you know, you know, and a lot of, a lot of people are just not a good judge of characters is what they call it. Just not a good judge of character. Okay. Now, you don't have to be in some instances because it's, it's all about your belief at the end of the day. That's not going to save him or destroy him unless he's an Israelite. But I'm saying on this side, you know. Anyway, I just wanted to touch on that. I had that question. I just wanted to see, uh, you know, how would that be answered? If tears are amongst our people and they look like so our tears can look like a black man. And a so-called heathen can still have uh, talent on high levels. Then that mean a talented tear that can look like a Negro, okay, to these guys, um, are they still an Israelite? Okay? So let's go back into, you know, the fact that if Michael Jordan... As talented as he is, is was, and LeBron James, let's say that, because everybody compares them, which is no comparison to me. But if you compare that, if they still look like Negroes and Tears can still look like them, and he just can have talent, could they still be Tears? That's the question. That's all I have on that. Shut them off.